Live broadcast, my name is Hibak Said. On sign language interpretation tonight is Irene Chebiwot. To start us off, after the tabling of an impeachment motion in Parliament, Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa is clearly a man fighting for his political survival, but with what appears to be dwindling options in his quest to successfully navigate the murky waters. He is currently in, as it were, constitutional pundits think that while his fate lies in the hands of parliament political intrigues might just be or might just blight his chances leaving even more limited options available for him options that include the traditional refuge of the courts and one other radical move moige william interrogates these options <laughs> Joffrey Rigadi Gashagua, a man who could be facing some of the longest nights of his political life that now hangs in the balance. This after an impeachment motion was filed at the floor of the National Assembly. According to one of the members of Gashagua's legal team, the truthful man is said to be prepping his legal arsenal to fend off the allegations leveled against him in the impeachment motion. <laughs> The heat turning up on Gashagua after 291 members supported the impeachment motion tabled by Kibwezi member of parliament Mwengi Mutuse, accusing Gashagua of an array of issues, among them uttering of divisive and insightful utterances, violating national cohesion and integration, undermining the president, corruption and economic crimes, gross misconduct, bullying, among others. With this list of damaging accusations, a section of constitutional lawyers fell at the stage Gashagwa might not survive the onslaught. Jinsi ya kumungatua naibu wa Raisi Mamlakani ina nguzo za kisheria za kikatiba lakini mawimbi ambayo ya nawezesha kumungatua mtu Mamlakani mawimbi ya kisiasa. If the political class are able to governize themselves and say whether what we are saying makes sense or not we have done our, our duty then they will have their way. However, these legal minds further believe that political scheming might carry the day in the move to hang a noose on Gashagwa's political neck. Even so, the stipulation outlined in the 2010 constitution places a high threshold to any attempt to bundle out any occupant of the Harambe Annex office. The beauty of the law we have, the, the MPs will use this constitution to impeach him. He will also use this constitution to go to court. The, the, the judges will use this constitution. A section of parliamentarians through social media have not shied away in giving a snippet of what awaits Gashagua if he opts to go through the impeachment motion by defending himself. Capsaret member of parliament Oscar Sudi, taking to his social media accounts, shared that, and I quote, no one has an issue with the majority of leaders from the mountain, save for one ill-behaved character. Even his replacement will surely come from the mountain, end of quote. Elsewhere, Labour cabinet secretary Alfred Mutua strikes an interesting tone, one wrapped in the idea of patriotism, and I quote, we are one country, one people, and it will remain so. That is why this motion of impeachment of rogue deputy president regarding the is not about politics but about saving Kenya's soul and of quote kila mtu alikuwa anafurahi nikiongea kikuyu nikiongea kimeru nikishinda kwa mlima nikisanya kura makosa iko wapi nikitembea mlimani makosa iko wapi nikichunga mambo ya watu wetu kama huyu mwiti kuhakikisha ya kwamba kama kome ametoka huyu amepata iko makosa gani mimi sioni makosa yote nimefanya no. kwa sababu hakuna mtu hana kwao the impeachment motion against Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa being a dichotomy of legal and political. Now constitutional pundits warn that during this process, politics might take the day. Mwege William, TV 47, Nairobi.